I greet you all in the wonderful name of Jesus Christ. My name is Michael Plachis from Springs, Guatemala, the side of Johannesburg, the side of Israel, the side of Israel. My topic for today is God is life. God is life. So we found out that in 1st John chapter 5 from verse 11 to 12, the Bible says, and this is the testimony God has given us eternal life. And this life is in his son. Whoever has the son has life. Whoever does not have the son of God does not have the life. So the Bible says that Jesus is the testimony of God. And this testimony, he is the life. And the Bible says that this life, he is the son of God. And this life is found in the son of God. So Jesus is the life. God is the life. The Bible says the testimony that God has given us eternal life. So Christ is the eternal life. And who is that testimony? It is Christ. And that testimony, who is Jesus? He is eternal life. So God, Jesus Christ, our Lord and our Savior, he's not just the life, but he, he is eternal life. He said to those who will lose their life, Though you are dead, yet you shall live, because I am the way. He said in John 14 verse 6, he said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. So if Jesus Christ says, I am, I am the way, that means he is the way, the truth, the life. So God, he is the life. The God that we are serving, he is the life. And the Bible says this same life, he is the testimony of God. And it's not just the testimony and it's not just the life, but eternal life. So God is life. I have seen so many people that said, I don't have time of going to church. I don't have time of reading the Bible. I don't have time of God or of the things of God. They, they said us, we have life. We don't have time of going to church. We don't have time to listen to the word of God. We have life. We have, I have seen people talking like that. And they don't know that since they said they have life, that life, it is God. And they claim that they have life, not knowing that there's no life without God because God is life. So anyone who is claiming that they have life, they don't have time for God or for the things of God or for the word of God because they have life. They are busy, they have life. Those people, they are deceiving themselves because there's no life without God because God himself, he is life and God himself is not just the life but he is eternal life. So there's no life without God. Anyone who claims that they have got a life, they are too busy for God. People, they are too busy for God because they claim that they have life. Not knowing that there's no life without God. And Jesus Christ, he is the Savior. So you can't obtain and receive eternal life without Jesus Christ, the testimony of God. There's no life without God. Life is found in God because God himself, he is life. God himself, he is life. If I'll be claiming or if you'll be claiming that you have life without God, you are deceiving yourself. You need to God because God is life and God, he is eternal life. And this is the testimony that you must believe. And this testimony, it is Christ. And not just Christ, but he is the life and your savior. So your soul and your spirit is not saved without God, the life. So God, he gives life. And we see God speaking to Ezekiel in, in Ezekiel chapter 36. He said, Ezekiel, can these dry bones live? He said, I don't know God. It is only you who knows. And God told Ezekiel, he said, to command the breath from the four winds of God to come and breathe to these dry bones and they shall live. So we also see God having his breath from his four winds. So this breath from the four winds, it also gives life. So the breath of life, it's also from God because God himself, he is the life. So I want to encourage everyone right now to receive Christ the life, Jesus Christ, our Lord and our Savior, and you shall be saved and you shall receive eternal life, which is Christ in. So this is the message that I have for you, brothers and sisters. Believe in God, for he is life. And without him, there's no life. May God bless you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen.